Hi, Mom. Hi, sweetie. We're doing two videos today, and this one was a request. And you can go ahead, and you said you wanted to say something to her. I want to say hi. Hi to Aisha, and thank you for asking. Uh -huh. uh, one of my favorite movies is <laughs> The Shooter. Right. I don't think that probably people would expect me to be into Let's Go to the Shooter, but I like this movie because I like the guys who are in it, and I particularly like the idea that ongoing in the movie, I wanted to see this guy win. Yep. I wanted to be with him in a winner's circle. Because yep. he had been right, as Mark uh, Wahlberg was yep. the person who was in trouble all the time. And mm -hmm. Michael Pena, I believe, was the one guy who did help him. Yep. Um, it is my, um, I don't even, can't even tell you why. I really think I like the idea of a winner, but I did in this case, and I thought it was very well done. So yeah. if you haven't seen it, go see it. And then let me know. It's so give a little bit of background on what the movie is about. You're right. Everything was right. He is an underdog in the movie, stacked against him. Right. It's stacked against him. Now, what was he doing? Can you give a little bit of a background on that? From yep. The service. And they're called snipers. And just so you're right, snipers, but they're called you. snipers. Yeah. But um, as the apparently a kind of a fake group comes together, says they're from the service and they need some help because. The president is under fire, and they think it's going to be a sharpshooter who will be coming after him. Mm -hmm. They are really trying to get him to take the role, kind of take the, the blame the blame for right? this problem. And so it ends up being that he's telling them how to, to get, take care of the president, but what they're doing is going to shoot the president and then blame it on him. Right, which they do. Yes, they do, mm -hmm. and he gets away and gets a way to, to take care of himself. I'm a nurse, so I was very interested in how they managed to take care of the of the needs that he had from his injuries and then how he got away. And what he did about it, I'm not too sure whether I appreciate that, but I appreciated the fact that they showed a an effort toward getting away from that and, uh -huh. and not taking the blame. So I, I just really like that movie. Yep. Pretty good. Um, do you remember the names of other people in it? There's some pretty big names. Glover yep. was the leader of the... Uh, uh, Danny Glover. Danny Glover was mm -hmm. the leader of the trying to get him blamed for yep. things. We'll Ned call... Beatty was in it yep. as a senator. He was pretty, pretty funny about that. I was going to say, as a side note and from me, and I'm sorry, and we've talked about this, mm -hmm. Ned Beatty wasn't in it very much, and yeah. I just forget how good he is. He was so good in every scene he's in, and Danny Glover's just Danny Glover. Yeah. But you're right; like all of them were good. Like they, it has a great cast. Sure. Go ahead. Sorry. Well, I was just going to add one more thing that I had thought about recently, and that is, if you get the chance, a movie that was a good deal like that in my way, the one that I'm speaking of, uh, but different in character. It was um, Matt Damon with um, the uh, Martian. He had to fight natural things right. because it's he a little got different, left huh? on Mars. Uh, we'll save we'll save Martian for another okay. one if you want to. I'd love to talk about Martian but with you. If you get a chance to see that one, see that one too. They're kind of alike. And thanks for asking. Yeah, and um, by the way, just for a disclaimer, Shooter is a very violent movie. It's got a lot of shooting in it and a lot of blood. Just yes. so you know. But if Mom likes it and it has a lot of that stuff in it, mm -hmm. I think that means it's a pretty good movie because she's not normally a gory movie no. person so as a matter of fact i probably would ignore thank that. you so much <laughs> yeah bye. and we'll talk to you later bye